What's happening? It's your man OG Bo Beats TV. Coming to you today with another special video. We deal with having YouTube. It's your man OG Bo Beats. And I'm back again with another video, a special video, of course, because all my videos are special. I got some dope shoes to review with a little story behind them on how I got them. Um, so we're going to get into that. Before we do, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you haven't already, please like the video. Leave a comment if you will. I reply to all comments. And I appreciate you checking out these kicks I'm about to review. OG Bo Beats, let's get right into it. All right, boom. So check it out. As you can see here, I got the box. All right, I did open the box. Took a sneak peek at the shoes, but not a good review. So we're going to check these out. Um, the reason I still had the box in the video is because I just recently heard that Nike was going to stop putting this just do it tape on the boxes aka just steal me tape okay this right here is a great great idea but it allows people to steal shoes right to know what you have in the box right in 2021 sneakers are a big big profit whether you resell them or if you can get a pair in your hands for nothing and sell them you're going to make profit everybody's buying shoes everybody's selling shoes so Nike, who sells the most shoes, is literally helping people identify shoes to steal, right? As you know, recently, my pair of off-white dunks that I got exclusive access to on the sneakers app got stolen while in the possession of UPS, okay? They got stolen while in the possession of UPS. Um, that's because they knew what was coming because they saw the tape. And I'm sure you can pretty much tell sometimes it's, it's in the box without tape, but it doesn't help. So Nike, if you see this video, if somebody else sees the video that can let somebody know, take the tape off of the boxes. I heard it was happening. Maybe this just came like this because they still kind of get rid of these old ways, but I just wanted to let y'all know about that. Now, without further ado, let's get into the shoes. So boom, there I was. Doing what I usually do in the morning, right? Probably doing some work stuff, checking my stocks, checking out the sneakers app, checking uh, Twitter. And I saw somebody post um, that it was gonna be a sneakers restock. I think I saw a tweet the night before. So I said, oh, okay, I think I even retweeted it. The next day though, I kind of didn't really think too much about it. I might've saw something else on YouTube about it, but didn't watch the video. And then, um, long story short, out of nowhere, boom, it was a little bit after 10 o'clock, it dawned on me, but then somebody said somewhere that the shoes was on there, the app now. So I go to the sneakers app, this is after 10 o'clock, like probably 10.05, 10.06, and they had restocked a few pair of shoes, which was um, these, which are the, are the uh, Air Jordan 3 Racer Blue, they restocked the Air Jordan 4 White Oreo, and the Air Jordan 1 um, Seafoam Women's. So I was able to hit, right? Luckily, somehow, right? I could hit on restocks and exclusive access on sneakers, but let it be a regular uh, draw or something that I never win. So anyway, got the box. Let's go ahead and take these out the box. All right, so check this box out right here. So first things first, man, I love this box right here, right? This is a dope box. Air Jordan 3s used to come in a dope box. Um, you know, I think they did the denim ones in a box like this, and then the ones, the Unite brands. It's not, is this a Unite? No, it's not a Unite. They did those like this too. Um, but yeah, anyway, this is a dope box. That Racer Blue Jumpman is, is, is really, you know, popping out behind the black box. So let's go ahead and read the label on the box. Label reads Air Jordan 3 Retro White Racer Blue Black size 11, retail 190. All right, check that out. See if you can check the label out. All right, so go ahead and open up the shoe, open up the box. You got this um, elephant print, beautiful elephant print paper right here. All right, and then let's take out the shoe. There's no extra strings or nothing in this, of course. Right, I don't think so. Nah. But anyway, Get another good look at the shoe. This is a very clean shoe, man. Very clean. All right, boom! Check it out. Air Jordan Three Racer Blue. Aha! Go ahead, and get a good look at the shoe. Um, 
Yeah, so, hey man, I'm gonna be honest with you. This shoe is dope. This shoe is, is really fire. Uh, when these came out, these came out July 10th of this year. And it was one of those shoes where a lot of the times, I love Air Jordan 3s, but a lot of times I'm like, man, they come out with too many styles and it's just kind of plain. And it's like, you know, um, sometimes I just don't even want to deal with it. I did want the Air Jordan 3 Hoyas, the navy blue. I never got those. I haven't even, I think I might've saw them in store in GS sizes. But um, yeah, so one time I did go into Champs and they had these restocked. And I go over to the salesperson and he like barely even wanted to ask me what I needed. It was one of those days. And he was like, uh, no, nah, we only got a 12. And he just left it at that. That's it. So I was like, okay, got it, buddy. I'm out. You know what I mean? So whatever, man. I, I left it alone. Um, but this is a dope shoe. Um, definitely. And just looking at it, it's got a lot of dope things. It's simple but dope at the same time. Very dope. So let's go ahead and check out the shoe. So on the bottom of the shoe, you got that classic Air Jordan 3 outsole. Um, but as you can see, you got this, this gray with the hits of blue in the front and the back. You got the blue, the race of blue Jordan right there. But I really like the gray in this shoe. The, the gray and the blue really bring the shoe out, if you ask me. All right. On the outsole, you got a partially white outsole. In the back, you got the air bubble right here. Looks like it's a little bit gray inside. The air bubble is kind of hard to see. But then you got this nice, pretty race of blue around the heel of the midsole. All right. So check that out. Okay, uh, upper of the shoe, you got this nice tumble leather, right? The way the Air Jordan 3 is constructed, the upper goes from, you know, around the front all the way to the top of the toe box. Nice white creamy leather. So around the front of the toe box, however, you got this elephant print, which kind of threw me off at the beginning, right? A lot of people I think it threw off. Um, but it's a reason for that, and we're gonna get to that momentarily. So you got the elephant print around the front of the toe box, and then you got it back here. Um, you got a gray tone right here, right? Which I never really realized, but you got a gray tone, right? Nice leather, this is leather. Feels like a little soft leather on the tongue. You got white laces, then at the bottom, you got the white holes with the blue inside the holes. Then you got that classic Air Jordan 3, that trainer, vibe up here where you got more gray and you got the white lace loops all right then you get up here and you got more blue on the lace loops all right then you get to the top of the tongue you got white at the top of the tongue with that nice big racer blue junk man i think that's dope all right then you got the tongue where you basically you can't see the back of the tongue but on the back of the tongue you got racer blue and then inside the rest of the shoe you got gray with a white White sole inside with a blue jump, man. You probably won't be able to see that, all right? But, okay. So then around the rest of the, the, the top of the shoe right here, going around to the back of the heel, you got this nice soft blue, race of blue. And then check it out, on the back of the shoe, you got that race of blue jump, man, and then you got the air. So sometimes it's night gear, sometimes it's just the jump, man. I actually love it when it's the jump, man, in the air. I think that's dope, all right? So you got the white tab, got the racer blue jump man in the air. And then, uh, like I said, so back to the elephant print. So apparently, and I'm gonna take a picture of it for you guys uh, after the video, or put it in one of my, my B-roll for the pictures, but apparently the elephant print is 3M, right? So that's a dope look. That's why it looks so funny looking because it's a 3M elephant print. All right, so this is actually a clean ass shoe, man. Like. I'm thinking about the threes I got, and this might be one of the cleanest ones I got because I'm a big fan of the color blue, right? Basic colors, blue, red, orange, green. And this is a, a dope shoe with a dope color, colorway, Air Jordan 3 Retro Racer Blue. All right, let me know what y'all think about these, man. Comment down below where you're able to cop these when they originally dropped. Did you pay resale or did you get them on a restock like me? All right, I'm OG Bo Beats. Hey, thanks for watching the video. Make sure you like, subscribe. I'm out. Peace.